Christian message on BBC. They don't allow us to telecast anything Christianity. Now BBC now, now he come come out to defend Christianity. Please open your eyes. You know I google so many things and I found out that the word letter J is not a sound in Hebrew language. Hebrew have no pronunciation of letter J. Their J is being pronounced as Y. That name, Jesus, right, which was given to us, are you getting me? Which is from Hebrew. The word Jesus in Hebrew is being pronounced as Yeshua. Yeshua. And the word Yeshua is being pronounced in English word as Joshua. Not Jesus. As Joshua. Yeshua. Please, Google it. Check this. I don't do any other thing than to study from morning tonight you get me now now how come that word Jesus because he said a virgin will have a son and his name shall be called Emmanuel not E as in E because E also is not in Hebrew word E is pronounced as I are you getting me Emmanuel means God also with us. God is with us. God dwells with us. Please, are you paying attention? In 1349, there was a man called Grigoliad. He was the first person that brought the word letter J. Every alphabet is being brought by an individual. get it now and this young man brought this very letter but the colonial master that colonized us uses a man which brought K to lift for us to make us servant look up here there are many quotations in the Bible that are not word God but individuality word Best, personally kept to enslave us, the Africans. Look up here. I don't take serious of any word, Timothy, James, Peter, Matthew. These are never disciples of Christ. I will tell you people what you don't know. There are many words put there by individual, by this England's to use it that time to be suppressing the black because 
they took your tradition, your belief, which is in Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy. Everything you see there is your tradition. It's African tradition. They look for what they can use to enslave you to serve them. I will give you some quotations that are not to edify Christianity but to suppress the black in the Bible. Are you getting me? Jesus' name in Hebrew was Yeshua which translated to English as Joshua. The white borrowed that name, Jesus, from the Bible to enslave us. But in Hebrew language, there is no word pronounced as letter J. It's just like in our language now, you tell that it's Chanyon. We don't have any pronunciation in Hebrew language. Chanyon. Are you getting me here now? So if Hebrew, where Jesus comes, there's nothing like J pronunciation, then how? Some questions are being used by the whites or the quotations some quotations are being used by the white to enslave us i will give you first corinthians 7 let's read from verse 20 to 21 you will see that this word was purposely used for slave trade. they will bring the bible and they will say we should read that time he said let each one remain in the same calling can god tell you to remain in the same statue of your limitation without going far without extending we serve a progressing god he said let each one remain in the same calling in which he was called look at it what called where were you called why a slave do not be concerned about it imagine this is what they use do not be concerned about you being a slave remain a slave do not be concerned about it. But if you can be made free, rather use it. Amen. For he who is called in the Lord, why a slave is the Lord freed? <laughs> that is not the word of God. But this young man, Paul, added it for a purpose. I will open your eyes so that you understand what these people outside country are passing through. In 1 Timothy 6 from verse 1, the same slavery they use is not slave to serve God. No. He said, let as many both servants as are under the yoke count their own master worthy of all honor every servant should count his own master worthy of all honor so that the same so that the name of God and his doctrine may not be blasphemed that is why anytime a, a black want to rise they suppress you people like us you can't intimidate us we have known the truth before now Colossians 3 from verse 22 Colossians 3 22. He said, both servants, both servants, obey in all things your master according to the flesh. Not with eye service as men. What? Pleasers. But in sincerity of hearts, fearing God. They are using that also to speak to us then as a servant. To serve them. In 1 Peter 2, 18, they chip in such word also to intimidate us as servants. He says, servants, be submissive to your masters with all fear, not only to the good and gentle, but also to the word H. These are words. Many of you don't know what is happening in the demonic world billions of dollars has been released to bring 
down African servant of God from the Asian country because they brought it to us we now read it with understanding and our God that lived with us start prospering us look up it when hip hop music started all this uh, Rocky Dupe Tupac etc they sang but they were not wealthy with it Africa now sang their own grace fell upon them you will see somebody like uh, all this Davido becoming trillionaires in a show they pay them billions I'm moving somewhere in ministry as in then when the ministers were preaching in our second country they used that for minimum, minimum of enslaving us none of them was enriched the grace of prosperity was not there even then if you remember they will call those that will give one million dollars one thousand dollars they should come out then upon all those money being tasked it was as poor as anything but when grace now fell upon through God's servant that God sent what happened African preachers were mortals the highest industry that excel in the whole world are pawns those that watch all this pornography film they will tell you the money pornography viewing center make a day they make trillions a day people are spending billions supporting evil but with that billions they are using to support evil that evil industry has no record of a profitable account please pay attention those that are comedies they make billions but there is no reasonable money investment you can testify of to some of them they now look and said African preachers has gone global Americans are not like you and I they always take time to plan what they will do in 2070 they will be setting trap for you people you will be following it you will think you are entering the right trap but not lie this indoors daddy is staying praying has opened my sir i have come to study what business will be in 2040 believe me believe me because what am i doing indoors than studying like them to know what tomorrow holds. he that want to know we know china's are there producing where they are gossiping look up here they now sat down and said what can we do look at this young man tv joshua he has broken record there are so many men of god great men of god now if they have succeeded in tv joshua own they will start attacking global men of god you see there are ladies that are confused there are ladies that are frustrated there are ladies that have no hope there are men of even men of the devil the church there are people that they know who no go marry there are people that are angry with god there are people like that that serve god faithfully and yet nothing to testify yes people look at the man and they saw how miraculous if all this miracle why where god used me if i do like this i brought go for if i do like this person go to my thought if i do like this person if those cassette thank god are not put them for air if those miracles they creep all these things where they could have started fighting for me you will ask yourself idawosa what killed him white <laughs> hey jesus what killed late idawosa all those they don't know of them they reached 40 70 60 
they are not wise eating and dying with your enemy is a worse way of thinking do you know when they now saw this man has done extraordinary miracle they said what we do even though he's dead let's wipe his name off because if a black man will be number one because after Christ he's number one no, I'm no forget it nobody has been buried the whole world buried him one man how can we wipe away you see the way they fought Jesus TV Joshua is Christ like he's the only man of God that died even in his grave they are fighting him only Jesus Christ and that man who he's a Christ like he's, he's not my mentor I don't know him but I'm just telling you now there are many girls they are giving billions the girls will say Can you hear me today? what am I make I talk am? What, what am? no if you die I go die I'll give my family the one billion they will say huh, he sleep with me he sleep with me any girl that can say that you have a thinking where is he where is he she no get shame she's there for everything even the mothers will support her because they will tell you this one will live in her life in her life there are some of my daughters here where monopause don't they hit. How can I say Ondo Kaid? Anything we go give us, give us, we go talk. They are no longer afraid of death. They are even praying to die. Anyone that have no sense was that saying, uh, you also can do it. If those girls and the other one where they adopt, say to your sleep, he's saying that you your daughter. Look at all facts that is coming out. You see why they buy anything that they do, they do documentary. People say why? People that left the church, the girls and the boys, the boys before they go, I go put video. Say so, yeah, on a, I carry money for now. I I I I, I hurt now. Both video of Max Solo them BC them we disciple them. The video day. When I tell them say when I give me money, when I help even disciple them, I say. I call them make come do church with me. I no for the for the for the video. I talk up. I said, no be tomorrow now. I'm not picking come say my mama get she out. I say I told na carry on a problem come. I they give her money. They deliver her. I told na come like other people. The video day. Why am I keeping all those videos? People say hey. What am I talking about my mandate? Why am I calling the whole girls that left here? I say una go go now ba. Eh. I touch una body. They say no sir. I sleep with you now. They say no sir. I say if I not talk. God will punish the family. Oh. They say, No, sir. I saw yeah. Go. You, my come. Video him. Mom. Mbaragaka. They ask him, No. I molest you. They ask him, No. All of them. Go say, Rama, welcome out here. Mama did they say, Mom. Were you ever molest in this church? Yes. I ever look you. I tell you, I love you. He said, No, sir. Talk. Or if you talk now, God will punish you. He said, No, sir. They go. Now, all those things. Tomorrow, God forbid, if God should come home, someone will come. Hey, he touched me. I know one talk because of uh, uh, he's a prophet. He said, God will kill your generation. Kill your generation and punish you. Which one worse pass? Now, somebody will not get because say, eh, you know, say, eh, they, they, you know, there are some things. This is what this TV show did. All those cassettes has start coming out today. All those ladies that are castigating him, they are all flawed. But because there are people that will hate you, but even if you die, they still hate you. There are people that, sir, once they cite you, but it's just imbued. Do you know there are spirit of jealousy? There are spirit of love, and there are spirit of kindness. There are people, but do no good. If they don't like you, they don't like you, sir. Kill yourself. You are wasting your time. Is it TV Joshua? If he's still alive, no matter how he's okay, between TV Joshua and other men of God, which one is God? If you say he's a winch, his own winch is the best winch. A best winch in the sense that he uses money helping the poor, feeding the poor. But you are using your own, building one billion capacity. But this man, me now, see me. No be job company, now they build school. 
make people now my family they, they work there the money where they get better now you give me they help the poor humanitarian till tomorrow only this week engineer's present i have dashed more than 2.5 million in your present engineer was telling me man we don't value money i said don't say i don't value money any profit i make belongs to god in my company not in church church i i'm not going once you are faithful before god sir forget it clear everybody here ministry of god continue once you are righteous before god the bbc that is castigating you can never telecast christian message on bbc they don't allow us to telecast anything christianity now bbc now now he come come out to defend christianity please open your eyes bbc will not believe in christianity now then come the digging 